Are you feeling overwhelmed by the clutter in your home, wondering where to start? It's a common issue we all face. Clutter can be daunting and it's not just about aesthetics, it affects our mental well-being, causing stress and reducing productivity. But the good news is, it's a problem with a solution. Decluttering can bring a sense of calm, control and efficiency to your home. Fear not, by the end of this video, you'll have a clear strategy to declutter and organize your space. Begin with the bedroom, your sanctuary. A clutter-free bedroom aids in better sleep. Now, envision your bedroom as a tranquil haven, then let's make it so. First, identify items that don't belong in the bedroom. This could be anything from dishes to bills. Relocate them to their rightful places. Next, sort the remaining items into three categories. Keep, donate, and trash. Be mindful about what you decide to keep. Ask yourself, does this contribute to my restful sanctuary? If the answer is no, it's time to let it go. Once you've pared down your belongings, it's time to organize. Utilize smart storage solutions. Underbed boxes are great for seasonal clothing or extra bedding. Closet organizers can help categorize your wardrobe and maximize space. Lastly, maintain this serene space. Make decluttering a regular habit. Remember, your bedroom is a place of rest. Keep only what contributes to that purpose. Next, tackle the kitchen, the heart of your home. This is where magic happens, where meals are created and memories are made. But to keep the magic alive, it's important to declutter and organize this space. Start by emptying every cabinet and drawer. Yes, it may look like a culinary hurricane just swept through, but bear with me. Sort all your items into three piles. Keep, donate, and trash. Be ruthless. If you haven't used that egg slicer in the last year, do you really need it? Now let's talk about storage. Drawer organizers are not just for the office, they are fantastic for storing kitchen utensils, cutlery, and even spices. Consider tiered shelves to maximize cabinet space, making it easier to access those pesky pots and pans at the back. Remember, clear countertops are not just aesthetically pleasing, they also make your kitchen a more efficient space. A well-organized kitchen makes meal prep a breeze and encourages healthier eating habits. Lastly, let's declutter the living room, your social space. This room is often the heart of our social interactions, so let's make it inviting and comfortable. Start by removing items that don't belong here. You know those random bits and bobs that have somehow found their way in. Now, look at what's left. Divide these items into three piles. Keep, donate, and trash. Be honest with yourself during this process. If it's not used or loved, it's time to say goodbye. Once you have your keep pile, think about how to organize these items. Baskets are great for storing remotes or magazines. Shelves can display your favorite books or family photos. And don't forget about storage furniture. A coffee table with drawers or a storage ottoman can be a game changer. Remember, the goal is to create a calm, welcoming space. A clutter-free living room is inviting and fosters better social interactions. You've now successfully decluttered and organized your home. Starting with the tranquility of your bedroom, progressing to the efficiency of your kitchen, and culminating in the allure of your living room, you've transformed your space. The benefits are multifold. Improved mental health from the reduced stress of clutter, heightened productivity with everything in its place, and enriched social interactions in your inviting space. Remember, decluttering your space is decluttering your life. Enjoy your now serene and efficient living environment.